This is the S&P 500 one day reading for December 9th, 2022. It's currently November 3rd, 2022, 8 p.m. Eastern time. Uh, we are bound by a important range. That's a range on a multi-day chart. Uh, that's the overall theme today. So difficult to determine trend direction based on that. But when we do look at the overlap, the overlapping energies from the one month, um, we have the Valor card. Looks like we have Valor energy towards the end of the day, Art energy early in the day, and Satiety energy uh, midday. Um, but overall, it's a bullish day. My sense is, well, maybe not bullish, but we, we bump up against resistance. Oh, we bump up against resistance, it uh, looks like, throughout the day. Um, behavior around the high, we, uh, we rotate sideways along key support, move higher to reach the nearest key resistance or I should say the nearest resistance period um, and then we fall back down to that support and continue rotating, si rotating sideways the behavior, behavior on the low is going to form the low will form after a decline that commences from a brief peak that's easily missed um, and I'm advised to trade around a big move to the upside possibly um, the start of a rally here um, All right, so in the pre-market, we have a move higher through resistance. We stay above it briefly, and then we do a full retracement back down through the same price level. There's a trade opportunity first thing in the morning, like right around the open. Three crisscrosses through the same price level, confirming a bullish trend um, right around the open. But then um, looks like we have a sharp decline and a lot of ground, cut price ground covered, but price change, if you will, in that first half hour. But I'm advised to be careful there. Um, we do turn around. Um, yeah, the decline early in the day um, is an opportunity. And it looks like first thing, really, there's an opportunity. But um, we have a notable move roughly between like 10 and 11 to the upside. Um, from which we fall again, multiple uh, headwinds pushing pushing uh, the S&P lower, roughly between 11 and 12. And then um, there's a holding pattern um, midday or either that or like a big move higher file followed by full retracement, either that or both. We could have a holding pattern and then that. Uh, but there's an agreement between two leaders that's highlighted, a merger of some kind possibly, or an agreement between two leaders highlighted there midday. Um, and then another sharp drop, some bearish price swings and a sharp drops uh, out of that midday agreement it looks like uh, between like roughly one and two o'clock um, there's something involving Congress highlighted here as well so an agreement between two leaders Congress highlighted something going on here on the ninth um, something going on there um, and then we have out of that low uh, holding pattern um, roughly between two and three, and then from three to, to three to the close, there's uh, first. Wow, first there's a, a sharp drop on a one-day start standing a chart standing out, and then we have a big move reaching to the upside, reaching for distant resistance into the close. Um, looks like I'm advised to open up some protection around the close. Um, the following day, there'll be a, a prominent decline or a prominent trough or bottom. Um, let's look at that one month. Interesting. Well, we go into Mercury retrograde on, on the 12th as well, so that's important to highlight. Um, All right, guys, that's uh, December 9th, 2022. Let me know what you think by hitting that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and make sure you follow that rule of karma, my friends. Appreciate all those of you supporting the channel. There's a ton of different ways you can do that, guys. Um, check out any of the links below and in, in our description on the YouTube videos. Um, there's a ton of different ways uh, that you can help out. Um, and with that said, guys, I'll see you on the next one.